All right, hey guys, I uh, want to introduce you to an old uh, school friend of mine. Uh, me and my son was doing some hiking up on House Mountain where I've got a, a video out on my favorite sit spots. And uh, lo and behold, uh, Chris jumps out of the car and asks if he can go hiking with us. And we're about halfway through the trail before we realize who, we, who each other are. And they say that people always come back to the raisin. Well, about 20 some odd years ago, almost 30, we went to school together, went through ROTC together. He ventured off into uh, the service and uh, I ventured off into plumbing. Well, we met back up on the mountain and uh, found each other there. And uh, Chris here uh, is wanting to, he's a little bit interested in uh, doing some of this video work. He's uh, more tactical. He knows more about uh, guns and ammo and some really neat carry systems, probably more uh, a little bit different than bushcraft. But I think that, uh, you know, in the near future, we're probably going to be doing some videos together. And uh, I'm going to introduce you to, to Chris, uh, Paul Crisp. And uh, I'll let him tell you a little bit about what he's wanting to do. And uh, I'll put a link to his channel on here. Go ahead, Paul. Hi, I'm Paul Crisp, uh, former Army Staff Sergeant. Uh, I've been trained in infantry, airborne, ranger, uh, some special operations, survival. Uh, I'm not the end-all, be-all, or uh, authority on every piece of information. I'm going to be in some of Bill's films. Uh, what I'll be trying to do is tie in the newer tactical and equipment back into the old. Uh, the reason I, I, I believe in doing this is you can have all the stuff you want in the world, but it won't last forever. At some point, you're going to have to get down to the basics and start making your own. Uh, probably be a lot of sharpshooters out there. I don't know where you live. The, the things you'll see me do are going to be based on my experience and uh, the geographic area I live in, the weather I deal with, uh, what's important to me, and the kind of things I intend to be doing. Uh, where you live may be different. You may need another setup. Uh, for you people out there with prior military service and experience, uh, a lot of these things you're not going to find very interesting. I'm going to try to be catering more to the beginners. And uh, I will walk up into some advanced stuff later. Uh, but I'm going to bring them up with me as I go. And I really uh, want to stress redundancy, uh, modular systems, things that you can use for more than one purpose, things that you can keep, repair. And uh, I want to tie it in as much with Bill's stuff as I can because I'm actually learning some stuff from him. And, and, and I believe in it. I, I believe in the primitive pioneering skills. And, and like I said, at some point, uh, like all fights eventually go to ground sooner or later, your stuff's going to wear out, it's going to break, you're going to find yourself in a position where you don't have it. And I, I believe this is a, a valuable skill and, and I want to tie into it. So I hope to be seeing you in some of the later films. Some of them I'll be helping him and some of them I'll do on my own. So uh, I'll be seeing you then. Thank you. All right. Well, very good, Paul. I'm glad we run into each other again. Been a long time. And uh, I hope the, the bushcraft community will uh, accept you right in. I'm sure they will, just like they do everybody else. It's a great community to, to get involved in and, and share information. Um, our skills are just a little bit different, but uh, it's going to be nice to try to, like you said, tie some stuff together. All right, guys. I'm going to put a link up here for Paul's channel and uh, go visit him. Thanks.